assalamu alaikum students hope you are fine today we are going to teach the same topic that is where we live now unit 1 come on page number 4 vocabulary first question is in the email from london which word means the same as bloom you can tell me which word mean the same as bloom the verb blossom means the same as bloom next what have you learnt about the population of london we have learnt about the population of london in first para paragraph the london is multicultural city with people from every corner of the world living here third question is what adjective means amazing the adjective astounding means same as amazing what is the special about the linden pass and green gardens students we have learnt about linden pass and gardens london has beautiful pass and garden where people can relax beside a lake or a pond there is an astounding variety of trees in london green spaces which blossom in the spring and turn gold and red in the autumn next is in the email from moscow which three nouns refer to places of worship you know which places of worship in moscow yes church cathedral and chapels sixth one which adjective means having eight sided octangle octangle octangular mean having eight sided which noun means partly melt snow soft mud in the email from havana which words are used to refer to the wing extensions which stick out at the back of old american cars american car with their metal tail fins the answer is american cars with their metal tail fins In the email from Nepal, what is known for a Nepal Nepali mountainous? The noun Sherpa. Next reading for understanding. Here are some points that are important. I am teaching here now. Four. Question number four. Why do you think the summit of Everest is called the roof of the world? You know the answer of these questions. Because it is the highest mountain in the world. Because Mount Everest is the highest mountain in the world. Next, why is the Tibetan word for wealth a suitable name for the job? Tibetan word for yog is nor, which means wealth. It is suitable name for yog because it provides us with food, transport, shelter, and also clothing. So it is. suitable now name for your six why do you think mount everest is so important to the nepali nation because it is the highest mountain in the world many people from all over the world come to climb mount everest and to walk and trek in 
stunningly beautiful mountains. Now come on next page that is page number 5. Here is the simple present verb. You have the idea of the simple present tense. What is simple present tense? For example, we use first form of verb. Any other you can tell me. Yes, first form of word and we use first form of word if the sentence is singular. We use first form of word plus S R E S. If the sentence is plural, then just we use first form of word. The simple Present tense is used when you are describing. Here I know I am telling you the simple present verb tense, not the simple present tense rules. The simple present tense is used when you are describing conditions that have extend, extended for some time. Most of the verbs in the email are in simple present tense. The simple present tense उस टाइम यूज़ करते हैं करते हैं जब डिस कंडीशन डिस्क्राइब कंडीशंस बयान कर रहे हों डेट हैव एक्सटेंडेड फॉर सेम टाइम जो कुछ टाइम के लिए हों मोस्ट ऑफ़ दी वर्ब्स इन दी ईमेल्स ईमेल्स में जो ज़्यादा वर्ब यूज़ हुए हैं वो सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस के हैं एग्जांपल्स एग्जांपल्स आर दी Simple present verb is. Next example is the yog provides us with food. Here the word provides is simple present verb. It is a singular uh, sentence so we use first form of verb plus es. Next point is compound adjectives. A, compo a compound adjective is an adjective made up of two or more words linked by a hyphen or hyphens. A compound adjective is used as a modifier before a noun. In other words, it adds information to the noun. Hyphen means the sign used to join words indicate that they have combined meaning or that they are linked in the grammar. Here are some examples you can see. A never to be forgotten holiday. A one in a million change. The eight legged insect. The four year old dispute. Dispute mean fight and jagda. An Urdu English dictionary, a Hong Kong Chinese writer, a foresight decision. Students, you have learned all of these points that I have taught you people today. Take care. Allah Hafiz.